Hey everybody, this is Ebone with Unbound UAV, and today I am uh, just getting started with the R9M Lite Pro for the X Lite. So, uh, I actually wasn't going to go ahead and get this, so FR Sky directly talked to them, and at first, um, they went ahead and said on, on my reply that uh, they were not going to support uh, the old X Lite. So, I was like, oh, come on, FR Sky. And then they, of course, they still asked me to, if I wanted to purchase, and I was like, nope. Uh, but uh, the other day, I was actually going ahead and looking through the firmware editions for the X Lite, and there was a firmware edition uh, under the uh, under the X Lite page on FR Sky. So I'll go ahead and include that link in this video. Uh, but uh, so it looks like maybe they silently gave uh, gave the X Lite support for the R9M Lite Pro. So I'm looking forward to uh, testing out the difference because I have been using the R9 M Lite for a while now, and uh, and it's been working well. I do wish it had more range, and uh, and that's why I was pretty excited when it came out. And it came out with a better antenna, so there's no more rubber ducky in here. So this is pretty cool. Right off the bat, this is the first time I'm opening it. I just got home, just got this out of the mail, and. Uh, I can already tell you it feels a lot better, it feels a lot more quality. The other uh, module felt pretty chintzy, so um, I'll keep you posted and post an update. I'm really looking forward to the uh, uh, the variable power, so it, it should automatically adjust and uh, scale to what's needed up to one watt. And uh, there has been talk about automatic firmware updating, so uh, that's uh, those sound all like great pluses to me. And uh, I'm really happy to be trying this module out now, especially since uh, it's supposedly supported by the X Lite. I'll uh, keep everybody posted on uh, if it works, how it works, and uh, do a follow-up video with some long range. Thanks. Catch you soon. Bye.